customize the inject name for CSS modules in view. JS, allowing you to control the variable name used to reference the generated class names in your JavaScript code. Here's how to achieve this. 1. Utilize the module option in view loader. Pass a configuration object with the inject property to the module option within your webpack configuration. JavaScript, module, exports equals, module, rules, opening curly bracket, test, module, link to dot CSS dollar, use. View style loader, CSS loader, loader, CSS loader, options, modules, inject, my custom class names, customize the inject name, closing curly bracket, comma, closing curly bracket, comma, closing curly bracket, comma, closing square bracket, comma, closing curly bracket, comma, closing square bracket, comma, closing curly bracket, comma, closing curly bracket, semicolon. 2. Import the CSS module. Import the CSS module as usual, but use the custom inject name to access the generated class names. JavaScript. Import my custom class names from styles module link to dot CSS. 3. Apply classes in template. Use the imported object with the custom name in class bindings. View. Less than template greater than. Less than div. Class equals my custom class names. Container greater than less than p class equals my custom class names title my custom class names bold greater than content less than p greater than less than div greater than less than template greater than visualizing the process benefits of custom inject names clarify code intent use descriptive names that align with your components purpose avoid naming conflicts prevent issues when multiple modules have similarly named classes Improve code readability, make it easier to understand which styles belong to which components. Remember, adjust the configuration based on your specific build setup. Customize the inject name to suit your preferences and project structure. By leveraging custom inject names, you can enhance the organization and maintainability of your CSS modules in view.js projects.